Coco is purring on your back. The rise and fall of your breeze. Hello, beautiful. Liam, how long have you been here? Not quite long. I've been watching your beautiful face. Oh, thank you. I'm so happy to see you healthy. It's all thanks to you. Thanks to your parents and also God. And you as well. You know that one of the reasons why I was able to stay strong all this time is because of you. Me? Yay, your friendship and care towards me made me hopeful. I'm glad I've been a source of hope to you. Yay, I hope you've got your bags packed already because we are traveling. <laughs> No, I haven't done that. Start packing. I'll think about it. Nothing for you to think on. It's either a yes or a yes. Okay, well, she had her things with me. What? Yeah, she's gotten another man in her life. And he's her everything, you know. And I'm just here, being fully myself all along. I'm really sorry this happened to you, Liam. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, it's nothing really. I'll be fine. We did it, baby. Yes, we did it. Did you already deactivate the account? Yes, I did that as you told me to. Good, that way we are free and safe. I can't wait for her to wake up and hold my hands. Look at you. <laughs> we are going to talk all around. All that she wants to do, we'll do. Seems like a plan. Yeah, it is. On Eddie. It's not in Charles. I saw him there in your office. He came to ask for my help. Your help? Why? He's in some kind of trouble. I don't want to see him around you. I've already told you that I don't like him. I know. Then why don't you just listen to me and stop seeing him? I told you he came to me for help and I couldn't help him, Charles. You should stay away, please, from us all. Still get yourself checked. Okay, I will do that. Okay. So how did he go with him? We talked on the phone and he said he wants to see me. You are not going to see him, right? I don't know yet. Maybe I won't. Maybe I would. What's that I'm seeing in your eyes as you responded? What are you seeing? There's this spark and your eyes are being rolled. You're not serious right now. Oh, I'm very serious, Monica. I saw your eyes roll. You still like him. What are you saying? I'm asking you if you still like him. I don't like him. Someone who left me and you think I still like him. Love happens in the weirdest ways. So I won't be surprised if you did. But hey, don't do it. Charles ain't worthy of thy love or care. Remember what he did. I'm not thinking of Charles. It's not even in my thoughts. Why don't I see her here? I don't know. You lied to me, man. She's not the woman who sleeps around. Do I look like a liar to you? I want to go home. Then leave. I'm not stopping you. You know we placed a bet on this, right? If I win, you'd leave my place before the end of next month. You just want me to be gone. Why? Because I value my privacy and I really enjoy it. So I don't give you enough room to carry out the bad things you want to do. Maybe something like that. I'm waiting for her to walk in. We could pay her for the night. What? Yeah, but most times she's out of reach for us, the audience. She hooks up with only the big men in the club. Look at those ladies. Shall we both go with women home tonight? I'm not interested. Well, suit yourself. I'm going home with one. Eric, don't do this. It's sin. Everything I do have always been a sin, so I'm not surprised. So you're coming? I told you, I'll think about it. Hey sweetie. Mommy, look at your princess in a normal state. Close to normal state. You're still recovering. I want you to remember this. Yes, doctor. I'll excuse myself. Don't go and be crying in the office. I'm here to cry with you, Liam. Yes, ma. Why would he go and be crying? His lover ended things with him, mom. Can you imagine that? Oh, I see. Sorry about that. She's such a loser for letting go of a good man like Liam. So he's a good man? He's a good man, mom. Don't you think so? Yeah, yeah, but why do I get the feeling that you like him? He's a good man, mom. Why won't I like him? And he's my friend as well. Okay, how are you feeling? Much better compared to earlier on. Eddie. Nikki, how are you? I'm fine. Taking the drugs already? Yeah, I have, and I've started bleeding with some cramps. Sorry about that. Do you need some massage? You want to massage me? Yeah, if you will let me. So we are back to being lovers again or what? Yeah, we are back to the usual, Nikki. Me and you. For how long? As long as we want it. What about Cynthia? Aren't you worried? You told me we could keep hiding this until forever, right? Yeah, we could. Until either of us gets tired of ourselves. I won't get tired of you and Nikki stop playing dangerous games with me. How? Getting pregnant on purpose for me, that's not something I am interested in. It's nice, really nice. Thank you, Daddy. You should go to the kitchen school, Rika. No, I won't. I know Mamoli made the offer because she's feeling guilty. Should she be feeling guilty? 
I don't think so. But mom scared towards me these days. It's unlike her. She's just doing everything to make me happy. Don't you like it? I don't eat it. I miss us having our fight. <laughs> You're funny. I miss it. And Uncle Eric has also been acting somehow to me. How somehow? I feel like he's distant. He doesn't come around often but we chat. He's busy. No matter how busy he is, he and her still see you regularly. He's busy, that's why. Plus he's going through some stuff. Like what? Business isn't going smooth. You know how things can be. Or he blames himself for what happened to me. Did mom blame him? No, she didn't. Why would she? That's something my mom would do on a normal day. Man, look at that lady. She's beautiful. So what do you say I get her for you? I know that's your specialty. I don't have any specialty right now. I'm done with this. Let's see. You're interested in Cynthia. I didn't say so. I know, but the way you've been looking all around. I'm not interested in her. I just didn't expect she'll be working here. Joel is falling in love, isn't that it? You're not serious. I'm serious. Wow, tonight is packed with so many beautiful ladies. I've been meaning to ask about Rita. She's doing fine. She's still grounded. Why hasn't she been coming over? Don't you think it's better that way? You don't want her around? I do. But man, with what happened, I don't think it's best for her to come around for now. I always imagine that you two would be together. Together? That you'd marry her eventually. Her mom would never agree to it, so let's forget about it. You have feelings for her, no matter how hard you try to deny it or hide under the shadow of an uncle. How do you feel now after the massage? I feel better. This is one of the days I wish you're not bleeding. Is that how much you have missed me? Yeah, I have missed you. You haven't. So many other women are at your disposal. That's true, but there's something special about you and Cynthia. Why do you have to mention her name? Why would I? I don't want to hear her name tonight, please. And remember your promise to me. I will give you the big men in the club as well. Make you the star of the club. And I also need you to train some girls. You followed my advice. Yeah, I got some young blood around and they need orientation. Why me? You wanted something more. Consider this something more. Zach, do you know Eddie? Eddie, did you go to see him? No, I didn't. But you said you did that already. Yes, yes, I did it already. Do you think Eddie and Nikki are seeing each other? Why do you ask? I had left my scarf at her place. I wanted to go pick it and there was Eddie's car. Does it mean a thing? It means something. Like what? It means he's probably seeing her and now it would make sense. Does it mean he's seeing her? She was pregnant and she got rid of it and she has always been jealous of Cynthia. Jealous? Yeah, she has always wanted what Cynthia had. I noticed it even if the rest of them didn't. So you think she's seeing him? Yeah, but I hope I'm wrong because this wouldn't be good. Monica, our wedding plans. Not now, Zach. With everything that's happened, I think we should calm down, okay? But this doesn't affect anything. She's sleeping, baby. She needs all the rest she can get. Yes, yeah, she does. What do you want to do after all this, when she's home? A private get-together. That would be nice, but make sure to include Liam. Liam? Yeah, Baker said all plans should include him. Why? That's what she wants. Do you think they are both having a relationship together? I don't think so, but it wouldn't be a bad idea. It's a bad idea, Charles. A bad idea? Why? Liam is a good man. Not for my daughter. Liam won't be included in my plans. She will be mad at you. Zach, I'm not in the right face of mind to discuss a wedding. You said next six months. I know. Six months is already here and nothing. Zach, I... Mom, did you tell Kerry to stay away from me? Why would I say that to him? Did he say I said something like that? I have been calling him but he's just taking my calls. It's already late. He's probably asleep. He doesn't sleep at this time, Mom. What do you want to tell him? I just want to hear from him. Call him that. Okay. He's not picking. I guess he's asleep then. I want to go over to his place tomorrow. I'll take you there, don't worry. Thank you, Dad. Why is he acting differently to her? I don't know. These girls are young. Catch them young. They are too young. Are they up to 18? Yes, they are. I won't bring underage girls to the club. I know better. Okay, I'll teach them what they need to know. That's my baby. Yeah, yeah. You will be in charge of them. They report to you until you get yourself back together.
Eddie, Nikki. He's calling back. Pick it. Hey man, what's up? I'm good, how are you? I'm okay, I missed your call. I was in the middle of something. Okay, I was just trying to prove a point to Rita when I called. She had also called me, but I have not returned the call. Are you and Rita having any issue? Definitely not. Why ask? She told me you've been acting different to her. Man, I've been busy, that's why. I know after what happened. I'm just trying to calm down on everything, that's it. Yeah, I get. But we are cool. Definitely have no issue with her. Okay, just try to, you know, come to your normal self with her. I'll stop by the house tomorrow. Okay then, do take care. Say hello to Monica for me. She will hear. He said it's work issues, that's why. He's the only friend. I know. Wish she could be close to you, the way she's with me. I've given up on that already. Past days have been kind of tough for us all. Yeah, I know. Eddie, Nikki. Cynthia, it's it's not what. Oh my God, no, no. It's not what you think. It's not what you think, Cynthia. Then what's this? What's going on here? I, I. He he was helping me to. You both can't even lie. Nikki, all this while I've been hearing rumors, but I thought you were my best friend. <laughs> I thought... I am your best friend. Indeed you are. I can see that. You should propose to her instead. Cynthia, wait. He locked the door. Why would he lock the door on himself? Joel, Joel. Eric, hey, what's going on? What are you doing? Why are you all sweating? I've been busy. Praying or what? Yeah, yeah. I thought I heard someone's voice. Someone's voice? Yeah. In the house, and what's going on in this room? You want to enter my room? Search it? No, I'm not. Never mind. I'm sorry for that. Oh my god, I can't believe this is happening to me. Why me? Why is this happening? I I thought I and Eddie were cool. I I can't believe Nikki would do this to me. My own man. <laughs> How can she do this to me? How can she? Oh God, let him not be that the baby. No, no, it can't be. Cynthia. Get the hell out of my house. Cynthia, you misunderstood what you saw. Did I? You're trying to tell me I don't know what I saw? Cynthia. Eddie, get out of my house. I am sorry. Sorry? Chito is my best friend. I am sorry, please. Baby, please. How long has things been going on? Cynthia. How long? Are you the father of the baby? No, no. I need you to leave now. Eddie, leave. Won't you give me an opportunity to explain myself? What do you want to explain to me? Please what? I made a mistake. Eddie, I don't want to hear it. Please just leave. Please leave. I feel different, mom. You have to feel different, definitely. Welcome home, love. Thank you, mom. Thank you, dad. I hope to have your whole decorated board. I didn't want it. What if, Liam? He's busy with work. He's meant to be here as well. We are to celebrate together. He would come much later. Okay, mom. Still, I put up something special for you. Mom. Nelson. What is Nelson doing here, mom? I can't believe this happened to me. <laughs> Cynthia, oh my god, I'm sorry I came late. Monica, he cheated on me. Again? With my best friend. What? Nikki? Yeah, he cheated on me with Nikki. I saw them. <laughs> oh my god. Can you imagine this, Monica? I can't imagine how you're feeling now. I'm feeling shattered, broken. I am so sorry, so sorry. Why would Nikki do this to me? Why would she choose to sleep with my own man? I don't know. She could have anyone in the world, like anyone, but she chose my own man. I'm sorry. If anyone told me she would do this to me, I'll say it's a lie. At least now we know what kind of person she is. 
I can't believe she did this to me. <laughs> Good morning. Eric, what? Joel, won't you introduce me? Let's go, please. No, you are not going to just leave like that. Do introductions. Don't mind him. <laughs> I knew I heard sounds last night. The bishop himself. I'm sure you had a great video session. Stop it, Eric. Please, stop it. Stop what? What am I doing here? What is you are doing? I know you are trying to humiliate me. Have I ever humiliated you, Joel? You know what I just want to know. Why? I mean, why put up the facade of perfection? I don't know what you're talking about. You know what I'm talking on? The perfect man. I fell into temptation, like you. I always fall into temptation, and I accept it, but not you, Joel. I don't know what you're talking about. Would you tell your fellow members about today's temptation, or you go out there telling them all to repent and give them a perfect way to be saved? May God forgive you. Amen, amen, and you too. But the one who needs forgiveness. Hello, Eddie. Good morning. Good morning. I've been calling you. I don't want to talk to anyone. I am not in the right face of mind. I'm guessing she didn't listen to you. She didn't. She sent me away. What are you going to do now? What do you think I should do? Knowing Cynthia, I don't think she'd want to forgive us. I know, and I really don't want to lose her. So what do you do? I don't know. I'll keep begging her, I guess, and promise to change. Only to go back and do it again, because we aren't stopping this. After being caught. It doesn't mean. Nikki, did you plan this? Why would you say that? Because you're acting like you don't care. Eddie, I'm interested in making money. Where are the girls? So you don't care about your relationship? I won't go over to explain myself or beg her. Nikki! Are the girls ready? Rita, good morning. Good morning, Uncle okay, Eric. Why are you home? Working from home today, that's why. I went to the office and they told me you weren't here. You should have called me before coming. Why? So you'd tell me you're not at home? You think I'm lying to you all this while that I wasn't home? I don't know. Maybe you're avoiding me. I'm not, Rita. Come on, I'm not doing that to my baby. My dad chatted me up. Which dad? Charles, he sent me an apology message to me, blaming himself for everything. I hope you didn't respond. I didn't. I'm scared about everything. I understand you. It's not wrong to be scared. I also get scared sometimes. Scared of what? What are you scared of? I was so scared of losing you. Liam. Good morning, ma. How are you doing, Liam? I'm fine, ma. You are here for you get together? Yes, I am. I don't think you should be here, Liam. There are so many lives to be saved in the hospital. I took the evening off. I still don't think you should be here. I will give her the gift and tell her you couldn't stay. I... Let me have the gift. I was scared of losing you. I thought about it as well. You know why I didn't want to see you again? Why? That's because I don't want to get attached to you, Rita. Attached to me? Never mind. You're trying to keep things from me. I've got feelings for you, Rita. What kind of feelings? The type that shouldn't be shared between us. Like fishy feelings? The type mom was talking about? Something like that. Okay. I should take you home. You're not going to talk about it. There's nothing to talk about there. I'm your uncle Eric. And I'm Rita, Uncle Eric. Let's get you home, Rita. Hope you told your mom you are coming here. Yes, I did. My dad dropped me off. I'm sorry, Cynthia. Really sorry. I can't believe this, Monica. Please stop crying. <laughs> Do you know you made me to go to Starlight's party? Really? Yeah, I was there, and you know it was so annoying to be there. I get. So I came home, Monica. Came to tell her about it, only for me to see them there. I'm sorry. I'm done with all of this. Really done. It's a good decision. I'm no longer working there. Nikki and I are also no longer friends. She's not worthy of being called our friend. She was to be my best lady. Can you imagine that? I can only imagine. Um... But I guess all along, she wanted my man. She wanted to have him for herself. Nikki, did she call you? No, she didn't call me. She didn't reach out? Not at all. Monica, I have been fooled all along, thinking that she was my friend. Little did I know, she wasn't happy with everything I had. She... <laughs> what can I call a friend now? When those I trust treat me this way? I'm still your friend, Cynthia. I'm your friend. Monica, I'm heartbroken here. 
Why do you want to sleep with my best friend?